ты мне греешь очага, я где-то там в баре кто-то поет. Мне не хватает тебя, нужен тот огонек, тот кипяточек, где горели там ночи, где поставили проб. All right, I got it. Arbitrary greens, everybody. Beer City Diver here, and we're back immediately to do our to do a reclaimer mission with the Space Family, Siler and what's she called now? You just call her Space Dude, Family. your fucking helmet looks cool as shit. It looks really familiar too. It reminds yeah, me of them. helmets I've seen in. Um, Oh, oh, what was it? Like a lot of like Japanese movies, but also um, Outer Worlds. Oh, Looks a lot like yeah. an Outer Worlds helmet. Oh no. Let me let me enter the scene. Oh, there we go. Look at this big bastard. Oh my god. Dude, this thing could eat my vulture for breakfast. <laughs> like, it would be like one egg on its plate. I don't know why I enjoy it, but half this fucking game is just sitting here waiting. Dude, I know. I was talking about that earlier. I was like, why did they do this? Like, like I get But it's fun. I, I get the space simulation part of it. And I get the, you know, like there's supposed to be some realism to it. I get that. I, I And it makes sense to me. But, but it's like, dude, it's going to take me 10 to 15 minutes to get over to this planet. It doesn't make so much sense to me then at that point. I I like it because it gives me a chance like, okay, I've been playing for a little bit. I got to go to this next place. I can start flying there and then go like take a piss or you know, like get a snack or something like I that. I do like drink. that. I mean, fuck, you could go smoke a cigarette doing this shit. Yeah. Now, I will tell you, once things start going, they've had times before where they were testing interdiction and stuff where you would be flying along and you would get interdicted by NPCs. That happened to me they yesterday. Would, yeah, they'll drop you out of fucking quantum and start fucking trying to steal your shit. Yeah, he tried. I got the fuck out of there real quick. Now, sometimes some orcs will do that. Like, they'll they'll go to, like, Seraphim or something like that, and then they'll jump towards, like, uh, Art Corp, and they'll, like, stop halfway, and then they'll... They'll uh, start the quantum interdiction from the Mantis. And How do you wait do that? Yeah, I have a Mantis that has a quantum interdiction drive. Oh. Yeah, somebody tried to do that to me the other day. And as soon as I dropped out of warp and saw a red sign, a red name, I was like, fuck you, and I just kept warping. I just re-engaged the drive. Yeah. Also, the quickest way to tell if you're in PvE versus PvP is PvE guys will have two names, like a first and a last name. Yeah. Since players can't have two names, it'll always just be one name or like something underscore, like ball underscore sack or something like that. Oh, yeah. This person had two, had a first and last name. Yeah. So that'll be an NPC. And since you didn't die, it's definitely an NPC. Fucking players, like... It's night and day versus how things go down. Oh, I wouldn't want to get in a dogfight with anybody in this game because that's all a lot of these guys do. Yeah. And I do not. <laughs> I might play against them in virtual VRC uh, flight simulator, but not this. Mm-hmm. Oh, man, I had such a great weekend. My weekend ended yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> Do you uh, 
Were you anywhere you could see the uh, eclipse? What's that? Were you anywhere where you could see the eclipse? Oh, yeah, yeah, I watched it. That was some cool shit. It was pretty neat. I didn't think it was as cool as a lot of people thought it was, but it was pretty cool. Because, like, yeah. I'm really into space stuff. Like, really into it. So, to me, it's just kind of like, it's neat that, you know, we don't get to see that often. But really, I'm like, it's just a rock going in front of a nuclear reaction. Yeah. Like, if aliens would have showed up, I'd have been like, all right. So, I don't know how close to the path of totality you were in. Like, I was right in the middle of it. So, I could see, like, it was the like the entire fucking eclipse. And it was wild that I could see most of it. It didn't completely go dark, but uh, it, it covered up, like, probably... I'd say at least 75 to 80% of the moon or the sun. So, yeah, like being right in the middle of it, like I saw like the full, like the entire thing. And I was like, what the fuck is that? Like naked eye looking up at the thing. Yeah. I could see um, a solar flare, like a a coronal ejection. Oh, really? Yeah. It was like, what is that? That's dope. Dude, it was it was cool. See, I didn't it, see it that because like... I was looking for it. Uh, yeah, because I was making fun of uh, the people on the news that were talking about like, oh my gosh, it's, it makes me feel connected to the universe. I was like, do you even know what a coronal mass ejection is? Like, do you even know? Like, it makes me feel closer to the universe. I'm like, you are so. Ugh, it just irritated me. <laughs> But yeah, it was like, it was crazy that something like, as small as that compared to the sun, you could see from Earth. But, oh, you're going to love Pyro, because they'll, because the Pyro sun does that. Like, you'll be flying along, and they have a warning pop up that says, warning, cor- uh, coronal mass ejection imminent. And, really? Like, you'll get warnings, in, and you have to fucking hide from it. For, re- for Seriously? Yeah, it'll like shut your ship down. That's that's pretty. I I really even though that would make me angry if it happened, I could deal with it because I really appreciate that. I really appreciate that. That's, I mean, that's a real phenomenon that would happen. It yeah, it's does. fucking cool. What is this guy over here? Is that the same? Oh, that's the same ship, ain't it? Yeah. God, I'll tell you what, I'm, oh, God. Oh. (laughs) Oh, no. Rip. (laughs) Oh, no. (laughs) Oh, no. Oh, no. (laughs) Yeah, I, that was my bad. Oh, I guess the ship isn't that tough. (laughs) Oh, my God. I was just about to deploy the claw, too. I was like, yeah, we're going to do this. I was like, boy, we're getting close to that. (laughs) You know, I can laugh at that because it wasn't my ship. Com link established. Same, it's the same shit. Attention, right, emergency security. Oh, there we go. Oh, that was not your, uh, probably your best day. <laughs> eh, that happens. Oh, God. How can they not fix this? How can they not fix something like the space station kills you when you walk through it? How can they not fix that? 
Like, is it so much of a hassle to do a patch like once a month? Actually, I'm asking. I don't know. I'm not a programmer. I have no idea. You know what? Where's my vodka at? Uh, I don't want to start doing that yet. Okay, nobody important. I've... Yada, 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 yada. I need to stop checking my phone when I'm streaming. <laughs> You still there? Yep. Oh, okay. Oh no, you killed Space Mom! <laughs> yeah, she's alright. I think I found the first attractive woman in the game. Of course she's a redhead. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, they put a lot of detail into this. Even, like, look at her iris. I think if they would have put played more attention to dying in space stations than make the eyes pretty, the game would be better off. <laughs> and we all wear helmets anyway. I don't know what fucking color eyes people have. I'm gonna make a dash for the. I'm gonna make a dash for the med bay. <laughs> oh, it's safe to the med bay. Yeah. Room ten. In this kajit. I gotta quit smoking, man. I can't even, I can barely sing anymore. I used to be able to sing like you wouldn't believe, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I was in choir for five fucking years. Nice. Though I did impress everybody at the bar the other day. They were like, uh. I sang some Metallica song, and the bartender yelled at me, Jen. She was like, Beaches. And I'm like, what? Like, I thought I was in trouble. She's like, you can fucking sing? I was like, yeah, I got a couple <laughs> other tricks up my sleeve still. We're not going to be able to find our bodies, are we? Maybe. I mean, we still have the location for the salvage. 
Isn't it supposed to come up as like a red X? <laughs> it's supposed to. Uh, fair, fair. <laughs> fair enough. Like there should be, wait a minute. No. Oh, I do have my friend. So like, does your base undersuit and helmet always respond with you? Uh, it always gives you one, yes. Okay, good. That's good. Good, then I won't die in a space station that should be perfectly safe anyway. Yeah. I can't wait till they implement, like, like they really implement the mule. Yeah. Because I bought one. Just because I was like, I'm going to need a Hilo to move all these chili dogs. Hey, what up, girl? Hey. Oh, you don't want to talk to me? Oh, that's fine. I went to go talk to an NPC, like, roleplay. I was going to talk to her. And she immediately got up and left. <laughs> Man, they didn't have to make it that realistic. I know. I, I was, I was going to say exactly the same thing. I was like, man, this is realistic as hell. <laughs> <laughs> That is a hell of a view. That really is a hell of a view. I should rename this video Reclaim Remission Dash Nevermind. <laughs> <laughs> I have a feeling my gout's gonna flare soon. Oh. That's actually really horrible, but the good part is is that I'll be able to just stay home and play games because I literally won't be able to do anything else. Yep. A fire exit? I think a fire exit in a space station is stupid as fuck. You could just suck out all the air and put out the fire. Unless it's a zero G fire. Oh. Well, shit. Or a vacuum fire. I didn't have any. I don't, fuck. A vacuum fire. Oh. Yeah, one of those. That'd be horrible. What do you think is a better fighter, the Buccaneer or the Anvil Arrow? Probably the arrow. Arrow, that's what I was thinking too. Did you buy that reclaimer? Yeah. Oh my god. I I felt so bad for you at first. Because I was like, oh no. <laughs> I was like, he bought that with in-game money. Grinded his fucking ass off getting it. And then he just rammed it to a ship with it. Oh, if you buy a ship in-game, you, you you can claim it on insurance and you still keep it. With in-game money? Yeah. What? You don't lose a ship you buy in-game. Like, it's in your hangar. Oh. Really? Yeah. I thought if you got a ship and you didn't pay for it, like, it was gone. Huh. Now, if they wipe, like they wipe the servers, yeah. then it's gone. Right? Oh, you that, don't, that's You don't right. keep that's it. Right. It doesn't persist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like the insurance of having it, though. Yeah. So I I buy big ships with real money, and then I buy small ships with in-game money. That makes sense. I just don't have big money, so I, just, I, I get what I can. I think I'm, I'm probably about at my limit. And you know what's crazy? I'm pretty sure... I mean, I don't know. I don't even know how to check that out. Actually, I can look at my hangar. Well, so I logged in and I had two. Or, oh, they came with a package deal, didn't they? What? Because I I own 
I've never bought a ship in the game with in-game money, ever once. Not even years ago when I first tried to play. Um, I have an RSI Aurora MR2 and MR. Uh, then I got the, the Vulture and Lancer, which I paid for. Then I have a Drake Buccaneer and an uh, Anvil Arrow. Like, they have wiped the server multiple times since I played the last. Yeah. Like, if you don't own a fighter, then, like, it gives you one. Like, if you buy a cargo ship, it'll give you a, a fighter to play, like, uh, the Well, like, yeah, so, ship. like, I got, I got the Buccaneer with the Drake Vulture, but what did I get the Anvil Arrow with? What, the Freelancer? Yeah, but then where did I get the RSI Aurora MR and MR2? Uh, probably freelancer. They, they they do weird shit like that. I still have an Aurora. Oh. That is a useless ship. Yeah. I do like how it's so tiny, though, and it still has a sleeping cabin. You'd still have yeah, to, it's not bad. You'd still have to piss in a bottle, though. How's this feed going? If we become like, we're like, if I start using the freelancer a lot, I'm going to be like a space trucker. I'm going to have to start saying stuff like hoss all the time. Where the hell did we go? Uh, where was our last destination? You're back at Arc L5. Did we go to Arc I'm L3? At... Was that Arc L3 that we were at? Uh, I don't remember where it is, but I still have the party, the mission. God damn it. <laughs> That's a good sign. <laughs> oh, it was Crew L1. Where's the crew L1? Is Space Mom still on? Yeah. Crew L2. Oh, I found it. Okay. I'm gonna head. Uh, I'm gonna head out to you guys because I could. If you get the reclaimer back, I could just park my Aurora in that thing. I think. Uh no, there's no hanger in it. Oh really? Yeah. didn't type that god damn it yeah chat server's fucked
Okay. All right. Welcome so where, where are you guys at? ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Oh, I'm uh, I'm gonna have to get a grim hex to fucking call this goddamn ship. I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna meet you there. I think I'm gonna take the arrow. I don't ever take the arrow. Five minutes. G God 